Hi folks, Greg Leifel at the San Filippo Estate. Today we're going to show you and demonstrate uh, one of the most beautiful orchestrians made. Uh, one of the largest two, this is a Hupfeld Helios 3, uh, cabinet style 39. It has a moving scene on it, among other things. Uh, I have the bottom panel and the doors on the front open. Uh, we're gonna give you a little tour of the insides before we hit the play button. So right off the bat here, we have a six roll changer. The bar that is uh, with the holes in it going across is the tracker bar. As the paper rolls by and the holes on the paper line up with those holes on the tracker bar, uh, vacuum is in there and it will suck air down and open valves and turn things on and off. Uh, looking at the side, lots of gears mechanisms we come over to the side these three pardon me for my light work here uh, these three are you'll see these operate um, there are slots at the top and bottom of those three in between those two uh, wooden paddles on either side of them uh, there'll be a thing that slides up and down opening a slot on the top and on the bottom go further to the right there's this really great uh, Universal joint down here, if you can see that. More pulleys. Uh, these, this pulley here with it has a lot, two leather belts. Um, these control the scenery. Those are uh, just leather belts that uh, help move the scenery for us. I'll sneak this in the back here. It's a little tight. Uh, just to show you what's back in here. Uh, this has 296 pipes, I believe. We'll come over to this side. More wonderful gears, mechanisms. Uh, these are valve seats. Uh, they are uh, named. Um, most of this is in German, but you can see cello and violin and viola, uh, clarinet and other pipes. All the way in the back, uh, you're looking at the, the tubes are lead tubes uh, that control the airflow. Uh, the larger tube that goes up and sort of hits to the left is actually made out of cardboard that's coated. Uh, that also holds air. Way in the back, you see a piano. Uh, you'll see the hammers for the piano, and this one has a mandolin attachment to it as well. A mandolin attachment is a basically a bar with leather straps hanging down, and at the end of the leather straps, there's metal rivets, and it drops down, in front of the piano strings, the hammer hits the metal rivet, and now you've got that uh, mandolin sound or what people refer to as that saloon style piano. Real simple mechanism for that. Uh, going into the bottom of the orchestrion, uh, this is a big uh, bellows. You'll see that pump up and down, that's your air supply. This wooden box here that goes all the way across uh, is an air chest going to the pipes, which Go way up in there, uh, more mechanisms and, and uh, vacuum. These little, if I can show you these, these little uh, pouches are vacuum and, and air pressure pouches. Suck the air out, you're, you're opening a valve. I can show you that by pushing that down, that moves that. Uh, lots of wonderful, wonderful, you even got these tiny little ones. Uh, so we're gonna play this for you uh, and I'll show you how it operates as well as to, well as the moving scenery up front. Uh, what's gonna happen, there's a little stick here on the end of the paper roll and you would load the roll by sticking it in there. That temporarily holds it. As it comes down, it's gonna hit this take-up spool and there's a little slot or indentation in the take-up spool. Uh, you'll see it grab the roll. Here we go. Lots of wonderful gear action. Here comes the roll. And here we go.
automatically kicks it into the rewind mode. Uh, in the scenery above, you may have seen the moon out, the moon set, and the sun comes out, and now the sun sets. Uh, if the song were longer, it would just keep repeating that. We'll give you a little shot of the, the rewind mechanism and these wonderful, wonderful gears. Here, it's gonna load the next roll on for us. And we'll go back up to the scenery while this roll plays, uh, because I believe the sun set. Have it folks. The Hupfeld Helios 3, uh, one of Jasper's favorite instruments. It's got beautiful painted scenery on the front of the glass, which is that old wavy glass, uh, original. Uh, we've taken the doors off and poked around inside with the camera so you could see it operate. Uh, this is Greg Leifel over at the San Filippo Estate. Uh, we do hope you come visit us when we are back open and hear and see this beautiful machine and others in person. Thanks for joining us, folks. And as always, thanks for your support of the San Filippo Foundation.